Hello guys, I am Lucian L and welcome back to Danganronpa V3 Killing Harmony Last episode, we started the class trial to find out whether Kaito or Kokichi had been killed uh, We don't know which one is the victim or the killer, so we'll see I mean, an exile just showed up who claims to be uh, Kokichi But we don't know and I have my doubts she had no reason to kill Kaito, that's one reason. He had just told us all that he was the mastermind, that the killing game was over. So what will he gain by killing Kaito? <laughs> it looks like you finally yeah. believe that I'm the one in this exosome. Nope, nope. Oh yeah, he showed us a video also, like proving yes. he killed With that, Kai uh, can definitively yeah, Kaito. With that, we definitively say that the culprit is... No. Nope. You. Huh? Why? That's not right. You filmed the moment the victim died. Which means you were present at the scene. Yeah, but the video is, As the I mean, could be edited. Footage, I, it, it's not clear. Even, after, even while I was editing, I was like, that doesn't really look edited. Or like Dr. Ed in any way. But, you know, it, I, I, I have my doubts. Yeah. But if the culprit shot the video, why would they go out of their way to show? Oh, man, you got me. That's another yeah, good point. I'm the culprit. Yeah, no, no, no. I can't Jeez, be right. I totally dug my own grave. Yeah. Here's the truth. I decided to participate in this trial in an exosol after I killed Kaito. Of course, it was mostly to make the victim unknown. To jazz up this trial. But then I why come out and say it? So I can you know? reveal it after it's you It's only been like 10 minutes answer. in the class trial. But <laughs> I totally spaced out. I wasn't supposed to show it right away. Is that right? So does that mean... You admit to the crime? Yeah, that's right. I I don't. Yeah. Oh, man, I dug my own grave again. Yeah, see, it's well, like. I don't think you guys will believe any of the excuses I make now. So, I give up. That's right. You're giving up? Does that mean it's been decided? Is it okay that this trial was so short? Nah, it's not right. That's fine. We knew from the very start that Kokichi was the killer, but before we vote. I want to say something to Kokichi. Oh, what's that? the mastermind, but I won't let you escape after you violated the rules. That would desecrate the killing game Junko and Oshima created, right? Your beloved Junko and Oshima. Huh. Junko? Whatever. It's voting time now. Let's go before Kokichi changes his- Nah. No, hold on hold a second. Hold on, yeah. This isn't right. The culprit comes in, confesses to the crime, and the trial <laughs> yeah, ends. Yeah, that, that's, that's just dumb. That's not how this goes. No. That doesn't sound like the kind of game Kokichi or Monokuma or Junko would play. Absolutely, yeah. What if the mastermind got tired of it? The remnants of despair were like the... Nah. No, if they were tired of it, they wouldn't have put all that effort into the video. Yeah. There would have been no need for this class trial in the first place. If anything, place. there will be... Uh, it will make sense Something's that they will take right. so much time or so much effort with the video. Situation. If they wanted to mislead us. I think Kokichi has some sort of plan. He's trying to trap us. Uh -huh. Trap us? Are you saying Kokichi isn't the culprit? Yeah, that's what I'm saying. Are you suggesting one of us is the culprit? What? If it's not Kokichi, then the culprit must be one of us. No. One of us? One of us. That's not possible. No, I didn't say that. I was just saying it's dangerous to trust Kokichi. <laughs> Shuichi is so distrusted. Well, the name of this game was originally Distrust, so... But it's exactly like Shuichi said! I'm actually not the culprit! Alright. Seriously? What? But that <laughs> contradicts what you said previously. Yeah, and, and he said it in a more sarcastic tone. Lie. Sorry, yeah. I lied again. There the you real go. culprit of this case is super bad at hiding themselves. So I thought I could help. I pretended to be the culprit by using the footage. It made the game more interesting. Okay. Uh, are you serious? Uh, what's the truth <laughs> and what's a lie? Yeah, I thought I thought the lie or the like quote unquote lie was, was that he was the culprit. Because Kokichi is the culprit. Nah. He killed Kaito. No matter how much he deceives us, it won't change our minds. Pains me to say, but I don't believe that. Kokichi has to be the only option. The only option. Is that really true? Are we just going to leave it at that? No, we need to at least, you know, leave any any chance out. I like how they even the 
<laughs> yeah, the, the idea they're like the sizes There's of no the, of the people. Is the culprit. Oh, we all saw that footage from earlier, right? Okay, let's see. Kaito got crushed to death. No, that's not right, but I don't know how to what counter that. What a horrible video. What a horrible Whoever video. committed that crime? The culprit is... Okay, okay, Kokichi I think Oma, I know... the mastermind of this entire killing game. And Kaito's killer. Kokichi could kill Kaito with the hydraulic press. That's the consensus right now. But is that even possible? Oh. There's no doubt that Kokichi huh. is the culprit. Yeah, that's a good point. We also finish earlier, right? Hold on, let me check the Wait. hydraulic press. Her hydraulic press controls are a short distance away from the device itself. There are two buttons labeled up and down. It also features a safety function. The body was crushed by the hydraulic press and is unidentifiable. Yeah, the safety function is, I think, where this is leading. We committed that I think so. With Kaito in the hangar. Was with Kaito Which in the hangar? Just yeah, okay. Just lips then Kokichi. Could be. Kokichi Oma, the mastermind of this entire killing game. Yeah, I think we're gonna go with the hydraulic press. Kaito got crushed to death. Yeah, but that wouldn't. Yeah, that wouldn't. Uh, nope, oh, I didn't want to do that. Sorry. Uh, okay, I, I'll go back to. <laughs> there you go. Boom. No, really. I even. I know you don't want to believe it, but he was killed by that machine. I don't think there are any other possibilities. <sighs> Crap. There's no doubt that Kokichi is okay. the culprit. Oh, safety function. I didn't realize right? there was one specifically for that. Kaito got crushed to death. No, he couldn't have. Yeah. Okay, let's go. Let's go. Boom! A hey, V point. So I was right. I just yeah, because it was in the record uh, when when I looked at it. So I was like, maybe yeah, that's gotta be it. But yeah, I, I didn't check my truth bullet. Sorry. Go with the press. A safety function. Yep. Yes. It was written on the safety precautions. Uh huh. The hydraulic press will automatically stop if its infrared sensor detects a living organism. Mm hmm. So the hydraulic press won't move at all if there's a living person under it? Yep. Which is why it couldn't have been used to kill Kaito. There you go. Which means it's more likely that Kaito was crushed after being killed by some other means. If it was Kaito, I mean, yeah, he does look. But look. Okay. So okay. What we saw in that we video, don't see his face when it goes down. By then? It like stops and then goes down really but quick. And when it goes down, it, we don't see his face uh, at that point. No, I don't think Kokichi would use an electro bomb for that. Purpose. I don't think it will work. It would have any... taken down the hangar's alarm system and the Exosol's remote control. It would have put Kokichi at a significant disadvantage. Yeah, yeah, because it has be a too big sure reach. I wouldn't do that. I'm the type who would do anything for fun. Sure, also, but it, we don't have there's any no record of, of that. Murder method other than the hydraulic no, we do. We do, yeah. I have a plausible theory for the murder. The the the, the oh. arrows, the yeah. There is a clue that suggests the victim was killed before getting crushed. I found it somewhere around the hydraulic press. Around the hydraulic press? Wait, what? You don't mean the arrows? There were three arrows in the bathroom. Perhaps the victim was killed there. Then there should have been evidence of the body being carried to the hydraulic press. There was. Was there any evidence? Yeah, there was. Damn it. There was. What the heck? There's the dragon of the of the blood. What? Okay. Uh then Oh, okay. There there. Yeah, that, that's what I was supposed this to show, it. right? Yeah, okay. Got it. Yeah. He did say he, he saw it around the hydraulic press. Yeah. Suggesting a body was <laughs> That's dragged. on me. Yeah. And they did give me a the clue with the yeah. Was the there any proof of that? All the way yeah. to okay. the press. Uh, that's clever. Yeah, oh, I like this angle. That was the restroom where Kaito was being held, wasn't it? Yep. Hmm. Blood stains were also found inside the bathroom. That can't be coincidence. Uh huh. So Kaito was killed in the restroom, then dragged to the press and crushed. I mean, whoever it was. Even was Kaito's. Yeah, exactly. What? I mean, I agree we with that. We only guess that Kaito was killed in the bathroom. Since his body was crushed, we'll never know if Kaito died some other way. Sure. We may not be able to examine the body, but we do have evidence that suggests a cause of death. That suggests a cause of death? Oh, the, the, the circle, right? Yeah, the, 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 the little... Uh, the, 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 the. <laughs> the hole. The small hole on the sleeve of Kaito's coat is the key to his cause of death. Uh huh. It's a small hole? No, no, no. There is no way that hole's got anything to do with a weapon. But Kokichi's clothes I'll had a similar everything hole. Everything you buy will go on sale the next day, curse. What? 
Himiko, oh wrong? no, that's horrible. Why are you freaking out all of that a sudden? That happened with Dang and Rompa to me, actually. <laughs> um, I'm not freaking out. I'm just saying it's impossible for the weapon to be that small. No? It's not impossible. I can show you. The weapon that left the small hole in case to sleep. There you go. And yeah, now we actually, yeah, crossbow. No, three arrows. Yeah. The arrows in the bathroom. What can you do with just an arrow? You're saying it's that. I was oh, wrong. Come on. I'm talking. Okay. I mean, it makes sense because logic isn't hard. Okay. So the, the crossbow, since I need to spell it, it out to you. <laughs> Whoops. I believe the weapon was the crossbow found yeah, in the Yeah, sorry. Bathroom. My face cam stopped. There you go. A crossbow arrow would certainly leave a hole that small. Can we then conclude that Kaito was shot with that crossbow? Think so. If so, that crossbow just might be the actual murder weapon used to kill Kaito. I see. It's so surprising that a crossbow is the murder weapon. What? Seriously, Himiko, <laughs> what's wrong? Yeah, this is weird. She probably needs to pee. <laughs> anyway, about Kaito getting shot. If that was his cause of death, then I wonder who shot him with the crossbow. I wonder. Well, I already know. But I won't tell you. He's just playing with us. <laughs> then let's show Doesn't him make that any sense, though. Is over. Let's show him that the students of Hope's Peak Academy will never submit to despair. Okay, Makoto. One of you, Makoto. Oh, despair. What is happening? Because he, he was like Junko? And then he was like, yeah, Hope, despair. Oh, because he hadn't had the, the flashback light, right? The crossbow. What a mystery, right, guys? Yeah, yeah, what a mystery. Who else but you could have done it? The shot would need to be fired from inside the hangar to hit Kaito. No, the, the, the window, yeah. The I hangar. think that's where what we had to counter. The alarm system and electric barrier were in the way. Jesus, what the heck? If we couldn't go in the hangar, and Kokichi had been in there, then he must be the one. I see, so I'm the culprit. Yeah, I'm gonna counter Maki's first, see if that's it. Kaito would have been in there, but the murder weapon was a crossbow. Now in that, we should be able to visualize the murder. I wonder who shot Kaito with the crossbow. From inside the hangar to hit Kaito. Respectfully disagree. Uh, boom and boom. Yep, there you go. Okay. That's wrong. <laughs> so yeah. I like, I like this. I'm liking that the logic makes sense, even if it's like a little even bit tougher or, or like it was specific. The shot with a crossbow. Yeah. There was a window in the bathroom of the hangar. Uh huh. Maybe it wasn't possible to get in, but you could have shot through the window. Sure. I don't think that's it, that but it, it could have been. Fine to the bathroom. Huh. So if they shot Kaito through the window, they could have killed him in the hangar. Yeah. Which means the murder suspect list grows to six people, including me! Including me? What do you know? What did you say? But put plainly, that means... Plainly? It well. seems Shuichi wants to make one of us the culprit. Is that it? Is yeah. Is that what a detective does? <laughs> yeah. Huh? Actually, yeah. I mean, we, we need to see the full spectrum of what could have happened. Do always accuse people, even when they're friends? Oh, then pull up the F card. On us. It seems like it. You suspected Kaito in the previous class trial, too. Did I? I guess I did. You're always suspicious of your friends. I am. What's up with that? What's wrong, Maki? <laughs> yeah. You seem like you're kind of on edge. She has seemed of course all throughout this part. When we said we would defeat the remnants of despair, someone got in our way. No, you don't understand. Oh. I'm not trying to... It doesn't matter how much you get in my way. I will absolutely defeat Kokichi. He's already dead, though. I think so. I won't let it win. Okay. Now, now. Let's stop this boring <laughs> fight and continue on with the not-so-boring trial. Not-so-boring. So we all agree that the murder could be done by anyone and not just me, right? Sure. Okay. That might be true, but I didn't know about the window. I mean, but you can't prove that. Neither did I. You can't prove that. Really, Himiko? What's the matter? You've been weird since we mentioned small holes. What? What? Are you after my small hole too? No. No, Himiko, no! See? Now that's definitely <laughs> weird. Yeah, what is happening? Look at it this way. 
Just because the culprit could be anyone, not everyone is a suspect. I guess so. We can pretty much narrow it down to anyone who knew about the crossbow. Ah, you know, that's actually a good point. Never knew about any crossbows. <laughs> I mean, again, you can't In other really words, prove I'm that. not suspicious. Ah. Uh, I get it. I get it. Yeah, it no, you. It concern me that Himiko went to the hangar last night. There you go, Kibo. Thank you. <laughs> Whoa, really? You went to uh, really? the hangar, Oh, my Himiko? gosh. Are you serious? Yes, she did. It's funny I when we saw her. Kokichi got so flamboyant. You, you were watching me? It's awfully suspicious that you went to the hangar last night. Really is. Okay. Then the culprit is Himiko. All right, chill with that. Wait, don't <laughs> say it's me. Maki's more suspicious than I am. If anything, because it, it, it was her room. I mean, everyone is accusing each other at this point. That crossbow came from your research lab, right? Yeah, fair enough. You could have gotten that crossbow whenever you wanted. Wait, can't uh, Kibo take like pictures or uh, like print pictures of what he saw? Anyone could have gone to her research lab, though. I think so, right? She's not the only suspect. Am I getting that wrong? I don't know. Nah, but I mean, oh, Maki. Even if you make that scary face at me, <laughs> I'm not gonna get scared. Okay, Himiko. Because if you start panicking, then we'll know that you're the culprit. Yeah, actually. I said I'm not the culprit. I swear. I mean, this feels like one of those like start the mini game, where you gotta prove that she She's didn't. The suspicious one. Oh, Maki too. They're both the culprit. Okay, okay, chill, girl. <laughs> I'm, I'm gonna need you to calm down, little girl. <laughs> Why am I a suspect? Oh, Anyone come on. Is this a Africa? Okay, I think yeah. I got it something for that, that actually. I'm suspicious. Okay, maybe I am the culprit. Yes, maybe I'm the culprit. I'm the culprit. Oh, come on. Okay, multiple debate or whatever. Mass panic debate. Yeah, that. <laughs> ah, shoot. Here we go again. I'm the number one suspect. Gosh. Oh, there you go. Then who acts the number one suspect? Shut up. I went there empty-handed. Yeah. Large black case. I think that's gonna be. Yeah, I, I went and left empty-handed. We should look at the inconsistencies in her testimony. There's a lie in there somewhere. Yeah, I know. Yeah, and it's exactly where Kokichi shouts. Yeah. Then I'm the number one yeah, there you go. Uh, okay, uh, stop that and boom! No, come on, freaking! No, come on. Okay, uh, no. Okay, yeah, she says I went into handy and I left. Wait, what? Did that hit? I didn't even notice. Oh, she did leave empty-handed. She just... Yeah, yeah, yeah. Okay, she went empty-handed, but she... Well, she didn't go empty-handed. She left empty-handed. That's what I was trying to say. Okay. Gotcha. Nope, that is not right. Oh, shoot. Get out of the way, dude. Okay, shoot. Boom. Oh. What? By empty-handed, don't assume I was talking about holding my chest. Anyway, I didn't have anything and nobody saw me. Yeah. Damn it! What? I Jesus, that takes away so much. I was in the hangar. Hatch a small empty I bottle. Keep us account. Pocket. Okay, yeah. <laughs> it's gotta be keep us account, a right? Yeah. No, come on, shoot! Get out of the way! Shoot it! Yeah! <laughs> I feel so proud of that, actually. <laughs> Okay, okay, yeah, again, it's very exp specific. You you I, I yeah, handed, it's gonna get me killed at some point. That's a lie, isn't it? Yeah. Um, what are you talking about? It's, it's not a lie. But it is. But Kibo saw you. Yeah. He said you were headed toward the hangar carrying a large black bag. Uh huh. Oh, I said case, right? Yes. Himiko was definitely carrying a large black bag. Mm -hmm. No! That was probably <laughs> Sumugi cosplaying as me. No, she doesn't cosplay no real can characters. Cosplay yeah. Someone unless they're a fictional character. <laughs> Himiko, this is the bag you were carrying, isn't Wait. it? Oh. That's the crossbow case. There's no mistake. That is the bag I saw Himiko carry. Mm -hmm. <laughs> Sorry, Himiko. Hold on. Himiko went to the hangar with a crossbow. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> 
Uh-oh. Well, it's decided it's that- not decided. Shut up, Kokichi. <laughs> I just put it there. I, I didn't shoot it. Okay. It's the truth. Please believe me. I feel like that's the truth. I believe you. Himiko is totally telling the truth. Yeah, you don't Not believe her. You. If you <laughs> believe me, it makes me look like I'm lying. Yeah. <laughs> that is true. But can we really trust Himiko here? She was acting very suspiciously. She, yeah, she was. But again, another debate? Damn. Hey. I like this music. Three arrows slash black case, small into bottle. Okay, culprit. let me hear it before. Yeah, I totally agree. I only carried the case. I only carried the case? Okay. Yep, yep, that's true too. I feel like I gotta agree I with her. Even use the yeah, didn't even use it. Mm -hmm. I feel like. Another true statement. And that's all. I didn't do anything else in the hangar. I didn't do anything else. 100% exact, Amundo. Small empty Why bottle, itself so protecting fishy? Monokuma, poison. Ah, won't shut up! Oh my Get gosh. Out of my head, <gasps> okay, this is tough. To hit Kaito with a crossbow, you'd have to be fairly good with it. Could Himiko have done this? That's the question. I'm not oh, okay. The I only carried the case. Oh, yep, the yep, crossbow, because you gotta. Okay, let, let me check. Uh, disassemble crossbow from the Ultimate Assassin's Research Lab. Okay, let me check if that a case w that had a disassembled crossbow in it. Yeah, because not everyone knows how to put it together. Okay, sorry, my face cam again. Okay, so it could be either or. Okay, because yeah, disassembled crossbow, it, it says here, but uh, maybe it's the large black case? Because we know she was carrying it, but you know, it, it was disassembled. Yeah, okay. Yeah, it's gotta be. It's complicated to assemble and will be difficult. Okay, okay, okay. No, it's a crossbow because it says, yeah, it, it, it literally says it was complicated to assemble and will be difficult for anyone who was, who, who wasn't taught. Okay. I didn't even use the crossbow. No, I believe that. Uh, mm -hmm. Let Another me check which one I have to use, though. No, I didn't do anything else in I the didn't do anything else. Okay, yeah, it's gotta be the, yeah, the other one. So she's kind of cute. Here we go. Even use the crossbow. Yeah, I believe that. Okay, let's see. Boom! Ah, come on! Mm -hmm. Okay, 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 okay. Boom! Mm -hmm. Another yeah, statement. there you go. Okay. Oh, consent? Consent? <laughs> what is... I don't think Himiko What's used that? the crossbow. More accurately, she couldn't use it. Okay, guys, sorry. I was apparently recording at 60 FPS with my, uh, with the camera, so... Yeah, I only have, like, 30 minutes left of footage, so sorry. Couldn't use it? Why not? It was disassembled, yeah. The crossbow inside this case was disassembled. That's right. Sorry. Fixing myself. There we go. <laughs> Kaito and I learned how to assemble the crossbow from my... Oh, so we're gonna be so suspects, yeah. But I don't believe someone without the proper training could have assembled it. Yeah. Well, what if Maki taught Himiko how to assemble the crossbow? Ah, uh, yeah, that could be it. She didn't teach me that, right, Maki? Yeah, she can testify to that. Oh. What? What's wrong? Uh. Are you mad about before? Oh. Sorry. I thought they were gonna suspect me, so I lied. Okay. I really have to question your morals if you're blaming Maki for your lie, Himiko. <laughs> I don't think you're allowed to say something like that. Yeah. I'm sorry, Maki. Please, can you tell them the truth? Fine. I'm not going to lie. Okay. I didn't teach Himiko how to assemble the crossbow. She couldn't have used it. Nice, nice. See? I told you. It's just like I said. Everyone who suspected me needs to apologize right now. Fair enough. She changed back so fast. <laughs> I think I might have whiplash now. <laughs> I think I'm whiplash. Then why did you bring the crossbow to the hangar, Himiko? I don't know. I was asked to. Oh. Asked to? Perhaps the person who assessed who asked was uh Kaito? That's it! Oh yeah. I thought so, because he was will it? know how to Kaito? Yeah, because he will know how to how Kaito? to build it. Kokichi wouldn't. Only Kaito or Kokichi would have asked for a crossbow to be brought to the hangar. And Kokichi didn't know how to use it. 
because Kaito knows how to assemble the crossbow, he certainly could have used it. Uh-huh. Knowing that, I can't imagine that anyone else would have asked Himiko. I do not Agreed. think she would bring it at Kokichi's request. Yeah. Of course not. Why would I ever listen to Kokichi? Because I know you like me. <laughs> nah, I hate you. Oh, that's adorable. But I like you. Oh. <laughs> don't fall for hey, that, Himiko. Don't play with <laughs> Himiko's heart. Yeah, chill. But the thing that Kaito. <laughs> anyway, the thing that Kaito asked Himiko to do that. Maybe Kaito is trying to keep the promise we made yesterday. Yeah, that he was trying to try something. He was going to try something. I'll do something about all this. Yeah, that's a promise. Oh, you guys are working hard, so I can just sit, sit back and relax. Absolutely. Why were you keeping that a secret, Himiko? Well, Kaito sort of asked me to keep it a secret. Makes sense, yeah. Then Kaito died, and I got scared. I thought it was gonna be next. Oh. You're the worst for trying to pin the blame on Maki just for that reason. Oh, shut up, Kokichi. Maki, teach this dumb monkey the true terror of human beings. Chill. Don't bully the person you like. Ah. Uh. <laughs> this is way beyond bullying a grade school crush. <laughs> Himiko, when exactly did Kaito ask you to do this? Um, I think it was around evening yesterday. I was so nervous about fighting Kokichi, I couldn't get to sleep. Oh. So I took a walk near the hangar, and that's when Kaito called out to me. I got startled and wet myself a little, and then he asked me to get him across. And wet myself a little. Just a little bit, though. Um, that one part was, uh, you know what? Never mind. Yeah. So if Kaito asked for a crossbow, does that mean he was going to kill Kokichi? He was planning to, definitely. No, he said it was to disable Kokichi. I wouldn't have helped him otherwise. Makes sense, yeah. I trusted Kaito and took a crossbow Aww. from Maki's lab. <laughs> that was nice. That's when I witnessed Himiko. But then, what did Kaito do after he had the crossbow? That's a good question. I know. I just handed him the crossbow, then went right back to the dorms. Fair enough. Presumably, Kaito tried to attack Kokichi, only to be disarmed of the crossbow. Yeah. And then, Kokichi returns fire and shot Kaito. That sequence of events seems logical. Makes sense. No, it happened a little differently. Huh? Both Kaito and Kokichi shot the crossbow. Word? And there's proof of that. Wait, what? Oh, cause the because of the, the, the coat? Is that right? I don't think that's a proper blah blah blah. Kaito's clothes had a narrow hole, so it's more possible to think that Kokichi shot Oh wait, no, I Damn mean it. I mean yeah, I meant that Koki that Kaito got shot. Oh, because they thought... Yeah, okay, so they... Okay, yeah, the, k k Kokichi's clothes. Then, uh, yeah, there you go. This is it! Yeah, okay. Sorry, I wasted a whole heart on that. Remember that when we heart? found Kokichi's clothes, <laughs> there were holes in the back and sleeve. The same kind of hole that was found in Kaito's coat. Uh-huh. So Kokichi was shot by the crossbow too? Yeah, and two times more and than it Kaito. Was Kaito who shot him, right? It had to have been. Mm not sure. I don't remember anything like that. You don't remember whether or not you were shot? <laughs> there is no doubt that they shot each other with the crossbow, but... It doesn't matter. What? Huh? What do you mean it doesn't matter? It doesn't matter what happened in between. In the end, Kokichi killed Kaito. No, that doesn't make any sense. Maki's been acting strangely. But why? Does she know about something? If so, what does she know? Maybe Maki's right. It doesn't matter what happened in the middle. No, I don't think so. But in the end, there's no mistake that Kokichi killed Kaito. <laughs> no, no, there, no, there's... Let's hurry up and vote. No! No, it's What are you too talking soon. about? There are still mysteries. Who cares about that? We already know who the culprit is. No, you tell me to act like a detective, sure I'm acting... Are that? Huh? Uh huh? What? Now he's joining in? <laughs> yeah, what's happening? As the one running this trial, it bothers me when anyone uh. says mysteries don't matter. All right, Monica, I respect that. It affects the overall entertainment value, so I encourage you to really think about things. Entertainment value. That's something he said before. 
specifically in the first Danganronpa, and spoilers for Danganronpa Trigger Happy Havoc, it, the, the whole thing was being televised. So, maybe, maybe here it's a similar thing. Anyway, back After to the trial. All, there should be some mysteries that still matter. Okay. For example, is Kokichi really inside that Exosol? Stuff like that. I agree. What? <laughs> what? <laughs> Wait, what? What are you saying? We already finished that discussion a while ago. There's... We have oh, AI. We have so much alive. stuff that could be... Killing game still going. Yeah. His no, I mean... Even coming from the Exosol and everything. But again, if, if it's an AI... Uh, it could be the same thing as Junko. Junko made herself an AI, like a copy of herself. And she was in, in the second game, again, spoilers, in the second game, she shows up as an AI. But we heard it speak in Kaito's voice earlier, didn't we? Yep, yep. Yeah, don't rely on that. After all, this Exosol has a voice changer. Uh-huh, uh-huh. It what? <laughs> Because of that, nobody realizes I'm pretending to be Kokichi. But no more! Sorry for the wait, guys! Oh, wow. Gonna come back and... Uh, oh, my gosh! The luminary of the stars has arrived! This time for real! I like this. I like... What? <laughs> What's going on? It, it feels very fresh. We, we hadn't I seen this you, before. I Kaito! I was just pretending to be Kokichi, is all. There's a bit of a situation going on, so I didn't really have a choice. What if neither are inside the Exosol? Sorry about tricking you. I guys feel like I feel like that's My the case. Bad. Huh? So Kaito's in there after all? I don't know that. Don't be stupid. <laughs> How many times are you going to be tricked by him? I don't know, Maki. That's Kokichi pretending to be Kaito. I don't know. Hey now, Maki Roll. Don't you believe me? Oh. Don't ever call me that! Oh Whoa there, chill. You really think I'm Kokichi? Did I miss something? Wait, don't. Okay, yeah, it was just that. I mean, I guess I understand. Sorry, I can't really get out of this thing right now. What? Why not? Why not? Yeah. I can't move because of the injury I got from Kokichi. In the arm? It's so bad I can't even stand. That's why I'm in this Exosol. In the arm? Is that so? But if you guys don't believe me, then we can't move on. Yeah. So we can't. You're up, Shuichi. Okay, thanks, I guess. What? Me? Uh explain to everyone how I wasn't the one that died. I gotta um, I gotta say, I, I I was very surprised by Maki's reaction. The the way she she carried that 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 uh emotional way. It was cool. Kaito's alive after all. What, what the heck? Okay, I mean, sure is she... No, maybe that's just what I want to believe. Is that true? What story does the evidence tell? Does that story end with Kaito or Kokichi being the victim? I need to give a well-reasoned answer to that question, and soon. I can't look away from the truth. The victim of this case is... It's gotta be, it's gotta be Kokichi. Right? Oh, I like that the clock actually runs south with the... Yeah, I like that. Most of the events will come now show... What? What's the matter, Shuichi? You just gotta say it with confidence. I can't look away from the truth. I am gonna die. Oh my gosh. Really? What? I'm trying. I really am, but I can't think of anyone other than Kai... What? Most of the evidence we have points to Kaito. Hey, what's the matter, Shuichi? Uh, am I gonna die? Get up and tell everyone why I'm not dead. Should be easy. No, I won't. Because you're not Kaito. Oh, you're... What? Kaito is already dead. Oh, my one more machine dead. will never die! Oh! <laughs> good, good! This is already Roboto more showdown. entertaining! Is now, that? No. the Ultimate Academy is proud to present its very own more phenomenal trial grounds. Wait, is there a rebuttal show? All right, let's give it everything we've got. There you go. Yeah, split opinion, basically. Which one is dead? It's Kokichi? And I say it's Kaito? It's just us two, what Kaito the heck? Kaito is inside the Exosol. Oh, frick! Come on! 
I want to believe that Kaito is alive too, but that video is definitive. We have nothing to counter it? Damn that Exosol, why will he confuse us like this? I suspect that Kaito is inside the Exosol. I got this. Okay, Exosol. Unless he comes out of the Exosol, we can't confirm that. Yeah, I agree with that. He said that he can't leave the Exosol because he's injured. Injury. Maki. Anyone who knows about Kaito's injury can make that claim. Yeah. Is it possible that Kokichi got crushed instead of Kaito? Maki. Crushed. Did you watch the footage? Kaito was the one who got crushed. Okay, I wasn't expecting to if go on Maki's arrow side. Hole on Kokichi's shirt. Arrow hole, arrow holes. I got this. Kaito's clothes had arrow holes too. Yeah. Okay, fair enough. I want to believe Kaito is still alive and defeated the mastermind, but oh, alive! I got this because the evidence doesn't support the claim that Kaito is still alive. Oh crap! That was wrong. Yeah, that was wrong. No! Did I? Come on! Dang it! We can't. We can't. Oh, well, that was an anticlimactic. <laughs> Whoops. Which one is dead? Yeah. I want to believe Kaito is still alive and defeated the mastermind, but Maki. mastermind. The mastermind is still alive inside that Exosol. Yeah, I mean Why that's the. Uh... So opposed to Kaito being alive. I think we're I gonna have to figure because out if Kokichi really is the, the mastermind. Kaito is still alive. Oh my gosh. Uh. Okay. Okay, I can actually do that now that I have this. Yeah. Come on! Come on now! Okay. This is our answer. Wow, okay, only uh, us two. Okay, okay, let's go! I don't want to believe it. In a way, I still can't. Yeah? The evidence. the evidence shows that Kaito must be the one who died. I hate it. I hate it so much. But it's the truth. I don't know with you guys, but I'm still in denial. I see. If that's the conclusion you've arrived at, Shuichi, then there must be no mistake. No, stop! Then the one here is... <laughs> looks like I messed around too much. My gosh. Sorry, that was just a little joke. What a sick joke! <laughs> what a sick... You're still an asshole. <laughs> True, and I can't forgive him. But we still need to stay calm, be rational. What is happening? Because we need to get to the truth of Kaito's death. Oh, okay. <laughs> yeah, just keep calm and carry on. What is happening, Monokuma? Why are Wait. You saying that? And what part of that was calm? Why did he look so nervous? Getting back on topic. Why don't we examine the crossbow a little more closely? Why is Monokuma I kind of on our all side now? Straight, so we don't fall for any more lies. Huh. I agree, but what do you think, Maki? Huh. Fine. Okay, let's discuss that then. Okay. Why are you acting like you're in charge of things? <laughs> yeah, so I mean... if we assume that Kaito and I shot each other with the crossbow, then the most efficient way to solve this is to set up a timeline of events. Okay. Hey, I said, why are you... Alrighty then! <laughs> Let the debate begin! Oh my gosh. Okay, is that why, why Marukuma is kind of like nervous? He's like, oh my gosh, this guy is way too good. He's better than me. Am I gonna get fired or something? When the crossbow fired, okay, what was even going on? What was Didn't going you need on? To ask, you were there. Uh. The crossbow was in Kaito's possession first. Okay. He probably fired the first shot at Kokichi too. Probably. When Kokichi disarmed Kaito, took the crossbow, and returned fire. Okay, maybe? I didn't take the crossbow from Kaito. Oh, what? I secretly brought a different one! No, that... I don't... But only one crossbow was taken. Uh-huh. The other two are still in my research lab. Yeah, exactly. Still, only one arrow was fired. So how could they both shoot each other? By the way, crossbow shots hurt a lot. <laughs> yeah, they will, I imagine so. fierce. What? What was that just now? I feel like that goes against the information I have. When the crossbow yeah, happened. exactly. What, what, what Himiko said it? didn't make any sense. Still, only one What are you talking about, Himiko? What the heck? There you go. Ah, I didn't hit the beam point. Come on. It takes so long. I need to leave way better. Uh, leave more. That's <laughs> what. Yeah, that. Wait, Himiko. What do you mean, one arrow? Yeah. Mm -hmm. Well... 
I only gave Kaito one arrow. Oh. So. Oh. What? Are you positive? Of course. There's no way I got that wrong. Well then, that's strange. We found three arrows. Yeah. There were three arrows in the bathroom. Remember? Yeah. This, uh, that is weird. Okay, so it makes Three? sense. I know I only gave him one. Huh. Kaito even told me to only bring him one. He said he oh. wanted to avoid fighting. Oh, yeah, so he just, yeah. It's happened, that's it. There were three arrows at the scene, but Himiko said that she only brought one. What is going on here? Um, maybe Kokichi had some hidden away? Maybe? Why would Kokichi have two arrows when he didn't have a crossbow to fire them? But we know for yeah. certain that three arrows were recovered from the scene. And all three arrows had blood on them. Yep, so all three were, sh were fired. All together, their clothes had three perforations in them. Yeah, G quick math. That's that's clever. So we know for certain that they shot three arrows at each other. <laughs> Again. Yeah, are you sure you're not the master detective, Kibo? Then where did those arrows come from? I don't think that Himiko is lying. There must be some angles to this we haven't considered yet. What is it? What could have happened? Think. I need to think. Okay, we're going into Psych Taxi. Okay. Wait, how do I accelerate with this? I don't know. I'm using a controller, so I have no idea. Okay. It's the X. Makes sense. Ah! <laughs> okay, one more. Yeah. There you go. How many arrows did Himiko give Kaito? One, right? Thinking time. Let it go. Yep, let's go. Okay. <laughs> that lasted way too long. Okay, one. Yeah, one. Okay. Boom! Hey. I like this minigame. It's a long one. Okay, let's see. Okay, just one more. There you go. Were all the arrows inside the hangar from the start? No. All the arrows, no. They, there could have been two, but we don't know that for sure. <laughs> the music is so funny. There you go, hey. Okay, can we go fast now? Yeah, okay, there you go. Who brought the two arrows? Nice. Thinking time. Come on. Hey. <laughs> I love when they say that. Thinking time. Dime. Time. Rhyme. Kokichi Oma Himiko Yumeno at third party. Maybe a third party? Oh. Okay. We didn't really find anything out from this. I mean, just the yeah, third party, maybe. Uh, maybe Kaito asked one arrow to other people, like to... Okay, how many arrows did Himiko give Kaito one? Where are all the arrows? Okay, yeah. Very interesting. Very interesting what we've seen so far. That the additional arrows were brought in by a third party? I think so. A third party? So someone besides Kokichi or Himiko? That's just a guess, though. There's no way a third party exists. I mean, we if don't know. If a third know. party did exist, why would they bring two arrows? Kaito was the only one with a crossbow. I made sure I handed it to him. Kaito said he only needed one arrow. Clearly, he didn't want to fight. Yeah? Yeah, that's right. So the other two arrows weren't for Kaito. Uh-huh. They were for the third party to use themselves. Oh. So the third party didn't hand the arrows through the window. Instead, they went into the hangar and shot the crossbow themselves? Huh? Impossible. There was an alarm system and an electric barrier around the hangar. Yeah, but through the yeah. window, right? That hangar should have been completely closed off, right? I don't know. It was completely closed off? But can we confirm that? I feel like there might be another way, some way that we might, that we haven't figured out yet. I'm overlooking something. Think, think. What method did the third party use to enter the hangar? What? I don't know. How do I shine this? Oh. Uh, S? No, okay. Fair enough. L? Okay. I? Oh, no, 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 no. I know. It, it, it's E. I need a knee. Come on, where the heck is it? Okay. Yeah, okay. Electro hammer. It's gotta be the electro hammer. What? Never mind, I guess. What? What's the question? What did the third party use to enter the hangar? Oh. Exisol! Okay. Okay, okay. This is getting interesting. 
Come on, one, uh, just one L, just one L. Was there an L down here? Yeah, okay. Okay. Cool, cool. Makes sense. That's it. The Exosaw. The Exosaw could be used to enter the hangar. Mm -hmm. So technically, they did use the Electro Hammer. We it's couldn't just, get you know. in because of the alarm system yeah. and the electric barrier. But that shouldn't have been a problem for any of the Exosaws, right? Yeah. So if you wanted to enter the hangar, all you had to do was pilot an Exosaw. Interesting. And Monokuma did say that one Exosaw had the, the alarm system shut down. Or the, yeah, the lock. So was this third party piloting it? Yeah. By the way, I just want to confirm something with Monokuma. Would the alarm still go off if there was a person inside an Exosol? I don't think so. Well, I wasn't trying to keep this secret, but since it's about the details of the hangar, I guess I can tell you guys. Okay. It makes sense that the alarm system and electric barrier wouldn't react to an Exosol. Uh -huh. After all, the hangar is where the Exosols are supposed to be stored. It'd be a hassle to disable the security every time an Exosol comes and goes, you know? Makes sense. So even if someone is inside an Exosol, the security system wouldn't catch them. Yeah, it probably has like an electronic... It'd be a hassle to leave yeah. the Exosol every time you have to put it away. So it's like Shuichi said, a third party got in an Exosol and entered the hangar? It will make sense. But can just anyone pilot an Exosol? Probably. Well, Kokichi... It's surprisingly easy. If you use both hands, both feet, and both nipples, you can do it. Why the nipples, though? Nipples, too! <laughs> anyway, this third party commandeered an Exosaw and infiltrated the hangar. That's a weird image. I don't, I don't like this. Let's move on from Some it. Some person must have brought the other two arrows with them. I told you that's impossible. Is it? There's no way you can get through security if you pilot an Exosaw. It's... Not possible. What? Are you oh. Not possible. Are you sure, Maggie? What are you talking about? What are you thinking? What do you know? What are? Why are you trying to hide it? Why? Why don't you tell me? I think. I think we have found who is our third party. They could have used it to enter the hangar. Yeah. That's not possible. It is possible. Is operating the Exosol. Really that difficult? No. Do we even know how to get inside an Exosol? Yeah, inside I mean, hangar, it looks pretty were easy. Exosol. And they were all moving too. Were there for Oh, I wait, was what? Controlling them remotely. Electro hammers weren't an option. Yesterday, all the hammers were still recharging. Oh, I know. There's no way to stop an Exosol. So getting inside one would have been impossible. No, no, it wouldn't. You're right. It's but we gotta prove it. And the Exosol protecting Monokuma. The day before the body was discovered, the Exosol surrounding Monokuma in the courtyard were giving commands to absurd moment. Oh, okay, I, I thought it would say how many. Okay, never mind. Possible. It's not impossible. There's there is one way to stop an Exosol. I have to show them. Okay. The so it's, it's either the Electro Hammer. Use the Electro Hammer. It's gotta That's be. Not possible. Yesterday, all the hammers were still recharging. Nope. There was one that someone used. Boom! V point. That's wrong. That's, wrong. That's right. <laughs> okay, okay, okay. Home stretch. It's time for the last few Not minutes of this of episode. Hammers were being charged. Yep. I know because I found one. That's right. There was a used electro hammer near Monokuma and the Exosols. Uh huh. Is that electro hammer used by the third party? Probably. Maybe they used it to disable an Exosol. Yes, I think so. Yeah. When I saw them last afternoon, there were four Exosols. Uh huh. But this morning, there were only three. Only three. Why is that? I Nobody knows. That too. Was the missing Exosol taken by this third party? Most likely, yeah. <laughs> Shuichi is getting warmer. Oh, How I like that. You say the answer right now. Who right did? now. Who is this third party? The identity of the third party. The electro hammer give, gives us a clue. I saw four exosols at the scene yesterday when I went up to meet, meet up with Kaito. This morning when we were trying to get into the hangar, there were three. The culprit must have used the electro hammer between yesterday afternoon and this morning. 
yesterday afternoon and this morning. There's only one per person among us that I think could do that. Hi, <laughs> Kaito Momo. No. Okay. I think... I think I'm right about this. I think so. It's Boom. you. Yeah. I knew it. I knew it. Maki. Because she was You're preparing the for the raid. For, so she you? charged. She had already charged her electro hammer. Yeah. What? It's Maki? Yeah, it's gotta be. She she kind of blew her own what cover with the with the electro hammer thingy. Remember what Kokichi said. Yeah. Remember, remember. Use your, your big brain. But to be careful, the Electro Hammer runs out of battery pretty quickly. So if you use it against the next cell, it'll run out of juice with just one shot. Got it? Indeed. The Electro Hammer needs to be recharged for 24 hours after it runs out of battery. Uh-huh. That hammer was used last afternoon, so it couldn't have been used this morning. Mm-hmm. Oh, right. When we were all gathered in the dining hall this morning... Maki, where's your electro hammer? Ah, uh, I don't need it. I'd rather not use a weapon I'm unfamiliar with. So that was a freaking lie. Maki was the only one without an electro hammer, wasn't she? Uh huh. Knowing that, the electro hammer I found could only have belonged to Maki. Yep. And that leads me to the conclusion. That Maki must be the third party. It's gotta be. She also knows how to assemble the crossbow and could have returned it to her lab later. You brought a different crossbow than the one Kaito had, right? Oh, there you go. Maki took two arrows and her own crossbow from her lab, disabled the exosaw with an electro hammer, and infiltrated the hangar. Uh huh. Now we just have to oh figure my out gosh. what happened after. I'll kill your logic. Is that right? Okay, bring out your Why sword, girl. Are you doing what? Why are you getting in my way? Oh my gosh. Getting in your way? Maki, what are you? Yes. I'm the third party. Oh. Huh? I admit to going into the hangar with an exosol and then shooting the crossbow. Okay. I didn't kill anyone. I'm not the culprit. I believe that. Yeah, I don't think she's the culprit, actually. But let's see what her lies are. Three arrows, large black case, electro bomb, used electro You're right. poison. Okay. I use the electro hand. And I use the exosol to enter the hangar, too. Yeah, okay, you did. I also shot the crossbow there. However, I am not the culprit. I believe that. Because the crossbow was not the murder weapon. The crossbow was not the murder weapon. Oh. It's no use. She's not listening to me at all. But I can't back down here. You're right. Okay. So we're not saying she's I the culprit. The You're just. We're just and saying. I used the to enter the hangar too. Okay. I also shot the crossbow there. Uh -huh. However, I'm not the culprit. Because the crossbow was not the murder weapon. No. It... Okay. The crossbow is not the murder weapon. What do you mean? It's gotta be. The arrows left holes in their clothes. Think about the locations of the wounds. Mm -hmm. They were on his arm and back. Yeah, the the back is An pretty important. To each of those spots wouldn't result in a fatal injury. I don't. That's why the crossbow can't be the murder weapon. Therefore, I'm not the culprit. Oh. Is it because of the poison? I don't want to think that Mac is the culprit. I want to believe her. But the way she's just scrambling the to defend herself. Okay. They were on his arm and back. An arrow to each of those spots wouldn't result in a fatal injury. No, it would. I'll cut through your words. It would, because if it had poison. Sorry, my camera again. I don't know if it's gonna. Yeah, it's not. Oh, it, it is. wouldn't matter where the arrow hit. Oh yeah. Okay. I, I thought the the memory had run out. Sorry. <laughs> we're almost done though. The poison. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. I noticed something about the poison in my lab during the investigation. There was just a little less in the bottle than before. Okay, never mind. Apparently we have much more time left. I, th I thought we only had like five minutes or something. If that poison had been applied to those arrows, uh -huh. they would have been lethal no matter where they came. Oh, yeah. Because strike nine affects no matter where it hits. Maki, 
Do you have a and we, with just a little bit, it's completely bru uh, deadly. What's the matter? Why don't you say anything? Don't tell me. Are you really the culprit? No, she's not. I don't think so. There's no way she is. Because why would she kill Kaito? It would make sense because she was like, oh, yeah, okay, he died. Bye. Maki is still fighting. Huh? Fighting? Do you remember that Maki said she would do anything to defeat Kokichi? Uh huh. Maki is trying to kill Kokichi in this class trial. She wants to kill the mastermind, a remnant of despair. Yeah. <laughs> then when Maki said she would sacrifice anything, oh. she meant us. The sacrifice that Maki is talking about must be Maki's life, Shuichi's life, Kaito's life, all of us. Yep. That's it. That seems to be what she what's been pointing to out. Sacrifice all of our lives in order to kill Kokichi. Yep. Sacrifice us? Then by hiding the truth, Maki was trying to get us to arrive at the wrong answer. More or less, I mean. Just to kill Kokichi and the rest of us along with him? I don't know. Mean that Maki's the culprit? No, not necessarily. She knew what happened and tried to hide it from us. But that mischievous plan was ruined all thanks to Shuichi. Here. Yeah, thanks to me. You're Too welcome. Bad, Maki. I already predicted this would happen. You knew all along that Maki was the culprit. <laughs> That's why you've been so calm. Yeah, totally. This isn't over. No, it's not. Mm -hmm. Maybe we do have the truth now, but this isn't over. We have a choice to make. We don't have to follow where the evidence leads. Mm hmm Huh? What do you mean? Does this mean you're gonna vote for someone else, even if it's not the truth? No. Someone else? You mean vote incorrectly on purpose? Oh my gosh. What did you I say? I kinda lost track. Kaito told me that only I would be able to grasp what lies beyond the truth. Uh-huh. The, the truth and even something that beyond, he the said. the truth is not enough. We need to grasp the hope just beyond it. Oh, I like that. So, Maki, please tell us the truth. The truth that only you know. Oh my gosh. Come on, Maki. So, Kaito said that to you. Yeah. Then, does that mean you guys made up before he died? Oh, yeah, we did. Yeah, when I went to see him yesterday. I see. Mm-hmm. Okay, I'll talk about it. Especially since it's my responsibility for involving everyone. Okay, let's go. Shuichi, you're so persistent. Were you always like that? I have no idea. We all have amnesia, girl. Uh, you think so? Maybe Kaito's charisma is starting to rub off on me. Maybe, yeah. Uh... That guy could be pretty stubborn. Then what really happened? Yeah, Maki, what really please happened? Please tell us. Please. Huh. And so... Maki began telling the truth. A truth that would leave us all in shock. No way. Don't just start narrating things. You're ruining the mood. No, this is like a... Like a find out next time on Dragon Ball Z. This is... Well, I guess this turn of events isn't exactly boring either. Okay. Yeah, that's totally... Yep, intermission. It was really good. This was so much fun. Yeah, let's save. All right, guys, but that will be it for this episode. Again, I, I love this class trial. It's It's been so good with all the back and forward, looking for the different ways of the truth. Like, it, it hasn't been, uh, like, prolonging too much in anything. Like, it, it hasn't been, it hasn't been tedious at all. I love it. I, I love this. Is probably one of my favorite class trials from maybe the whole franchise. And I, I'm excited to see what the truth is. Because we are either going to find out what actually happened, or like Kaito said, we're going to find out something even beyond that. I don't know if that will happen this chapter or the next one, or if there's anything else afterwards, but we'll see. Anyway, that'll be it for me. Thank you so much for watching, guys. Thank you so much if you made it this far. Leave a comment. Let me know what you would like to see next. And leave a like if you liked it. 
uh, let me know how soon you would like to see that. Hold on, I gotta give a shout out to someone who was... I'm now pre premiering these episodes every Saturday. I don't know if I'll post this on Saturday since I'm recording on, uh, on Tuesday. But I want to give a very, very special shout out to Kato Ace. I don't know if you're in the chat right now watching the premiere, but thank you so much for being here, for making it this far in the premiere. And yeah, I will see you guys next time. And <laughs> if you comment in the super, in the, uh, and if you comment in the premiere, and I, I'm I'm there usually if I'm if I'm watching along with y'all. So yeah, I'll, I'll be there to cast your comments, and I'll give you a shout out if you leave like an interesting thing. So once again, I'm Blue Channel. And I'll see you next time. Goodbye.